Hey folks, it's Frithgar here, how you doing? So, we are in the free play mode, uh, where we have everything unlocked and everything available to us. We have unlimited funds, all we want to do really is try and generate a decent profit per day. Now we're losing £273 a day at the moment, because I've got a load of explorers in, and I've got some research scientists. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use some of these upgrade points that I've got. Um, if I put three into that one and three into an ionizer, then uh, we probably going to use a pill printer, so we'll upgrade that one. Uh, we are using the centrifuge at the moment. Um, so if we upgrade that, it'll go from 32 down to 28 each time. Oh, well, actually, no, it goes from 40. Was it 40 down to 32? Uh, let's do another upgrade. So that one's nice and cheap now. At the moment, we're bringing in... Uh, there was this uh, this one here, the multicolored phyrexianide essence. We're bringing that one in. So uh, we'll upgrade that one so we get a, a, a reduction as 20%. It's a 30% discount on that one. Uh, and what was the other one? Oh, yes, we're bringing in this one here as well. Treats diabetes. Um, we'll... Oh, we've already upgraded that one a couple times. Let's upgrade that one twice more. Uh, that's a 40% discount on that one. This one we can't upgrade for the moment. So we've done all our upgrades. Uh, there's nothing else we really need to worry about. We're going to keep the researchers because we want to be able to uh, spin a profit even though we got those. Now, we're using the centrifuge. And that swaps out a load of effects. So what we're getting out the other end is we're getting one drug that treats diabetes and increases blood pressure. And... This can upgrade to cure hyperthyroidism. The other side, oops, not that one, this side, we already have hyperthyroidism, and this one has all sorts of side effects. What I'd like to try and do is, because I, if I go back to here, yeah, that, that, basically it's, um, I want to try and change some of this round, although I need that one and that one in together. So what we're getting going in is we get these three going, so I want that one and the top one to come out together. Hyperthyroidism, I want number one and number three to come out together. So if I look on here, if I click here and I do that, I will get, hopefully, the right levels of ingredients coming out the other end. So what I'm going to do is I will leave those like that. I'll add some, I will, actually, first of all, if I delete all of these belts here, then I'll add in two belts on each one like that and that will just give us an idea of what we're going to get coming out so we'll let it run this is the one that uh, we don't want to come out it's the next one that we want to come out this one here is not actually doing anything at all it's, it's both the same it's just running straight through uh, so we need to wait for a little while until these can move around. Right, now, we've got coming out of here, we've got hyperthyroidism and treats diabetes, and then the blood pressure one over there, and then this side. Okay, so that's not working right. So let's just pause that a moment. We don't have the right ones coming out there. Uh, so that was those like that. It's rather difficult to make sure that you do get it right. So I've got that one. Why is it not coming out correctly? I want the top one. You cannot remove the blood pressure one. Apparently, but... Well, it should just shuffle it round. Prompts fits. Oh, maybe it's because it's keeping it from the same one. So what I want to do is... I want to keep... I don't want that one. It, can I do it like that? Would that do it? Yes, because that's on... No, oh, no. That, yeah, I want the top line and I want the third line down, don't I? Uh, oh, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. So I, I had it like that. I, I, I Basically, I want to swap them right round. I want to do the exact opposite, like that. I bet that will get me what I want. Just a moment. We'll soon find out. Choose effects to swap. Hopefully, I've, hopefully I'm, I'm sort of uh, assessing this correctly. I'm not, I'm not entirely sure if I've got this right. Uh, it's all sort of lucky guess for me at the moment. So let's just pop in a couple of belts here and press play and we'll see what happens. I'll remove those belts because uh, those first ones coming out will be the liquids that we've already got. 
This one here is going to be the new one coming out. There, now I've got another one. So, causes constipation and prompts fits, and then this side treats diabetes and... No, still wrong. Still wrong. Right, well, I guess I had it right the first time. It's the top two, because it doesn't seem to be doing anything else. Uh, all right, let's try it like that. See what that does. I can't see that it's going to come out correctly, but I can always hope. Once I've got it right, I'll be able to sort of uh, reassess some of these things. Let me um, let me do it on this one. So I want to do like that, I think. Can I, maybe if I just try that. Because you get two things coming out of here, don't you? So the first one we had seemed to be correct. At the moment, though, this ain't right. It just ain't right, folks. It just ain't right. So I need that one combined with that one. And, right, what do we got now? Okay, I've got three of them on there. And i got two of them on there. That's still not coming out correctly. Uh, so if I... Maybe if I do that. Do those three. I mean, does it have one side that it prefers over the other? Maybe that's what it needs to do. Yeah, so, well, I need those two. Well, I need that one. And then on this one here, I need that one. I'm guessing that we can't change it round very well. Uh, what have I done on this one? I got it! I got it on this one! What happened? What did I do? Two greens in the middle and a red top and bottom. Is that... Is that, yeah, but I thought that's what I did on this one. Two greens in the middle. Okay, I don't know how that one's come out right, but let's just try this again and see what we get. That isn't right. But this one here, this is this is exactly what we want. How did I get that? That's what I'm, uh, that's the one I want there, right there. Both of them to get ooh. Yes! That works. So I could have this, and that's all of it, and I'll lose the the second ingredient. I, I need to kind of get rid of the second ingredient really um or i could actually if i go back to the other one i just have a treats diabetes pill and send that straight out the door okay that's what we'll do now that i've done all that i don't actually want it so right so th there is ways there is ways to uh, make it all work but what i actually want to do is that uh two greens and two reds like that. I think that's the right way. Put those out there. That's all the previous ones there. So I need an extra one all the way through. And there's the new ones. Right. So I've got the thyroidism. I've got a whole load of side effects, which I'm not going to worry about because I can remove those later on. And then I've got a diabetes drug here, which is coming out at the correct concentration as well. This one's coming out at a six. I'm guessing if I change the concentrations, that's a 6, and this one's coming in at a 2. I don't actually need to do anything to the other one. I can just package it up and sell it, just as it is. That one's coming out wrong. These two are correct. So it's just this one here, the two red... Ah, that's why. need to do them that way around. There. Okay. Put a belt on there. Remove the belt. Put a belt back. Right, now, I should have two sets of correct ingredients coming out. There we go. So, there's one. And there's the other one. Right, that one's out of two already. So, all I need to do is turn that into a pill. If I go for the makers and the pill printer, the creamer increases combined value by 30%. Uh, 30 pounds. Reduces strength. Uh, combined value by for each... No, we'll just go for a pill printer. We don't want anything fancy with this. We just want the pills. And I'll put them there, like that. Now, I'm going to take one belt coming out here like this. And then, whoops, I didn't want to do that. That's the one that I'm after there. So I want one that's going to come in there. That will run straight around into the pill printer. got to go up one I think like that there and that's also going to run up one 
do that one out there. That'll run into there. This one here is going to come out and across this belt. Invalid position. There we go. And then it's got to come out. Well, actually, I think it can just come straight across here, can't it? I'm not Product sure. name required. I'll put that one out across the belt here. And we'll go up over here like this. And this one can continue that way. So I should, in theory, have one lock coming out that way and another lock going out the other way. So this one here is the diabetes pill. So I can name that one. That's going to go out the door. All the rest of them, I should hopefully have everything coming out the correct way. I have the um, diabetes one running down here. And then the other one, which is what we're going to need for our next upgrade. This one, I now need to reduce it down to one to two. I've already got the catalyst involved, so uh, I need to drop down four points. If I go to my, uh, that increases, that decreases. I want an ionizer, and then I probably want a dissolver as well. Uh, if I pop that one right there like that, and then I get a dissolver, that one can pop out there like that. So a belt runs in here, and a belt runs there, and then that one, come out and I'll put it right down into that corner so let's just play this through make sure that everything is coming out okay so I got my um, special pill running out that side I'm gonna need to wait a little while just for some of these to catch up with what they're doing and then hopefully we'll start it'll kind of um, synchronize itself with everything that's on the table that's all running through that one's gonna run on through Hopefully, it'll all kind of uh, synchronize in quite nicely soon. The only problem is, I think I'm going to need to change this slightly. I think this belt isn't going to allow me to have all of them running through as they should. It seems to be too full. It might work. We'll soon find out, because it'll come out uh, full over this end and it'll need to be full over this end. So anyway, we're up to here with hypothyroidism. Uh, we need a chromatograph now. So the chromatograph is one of the advanced machines. And to upgrade with this one, I want to keep it running three per day like I have been. Uh, that's going to be in the wrong place. So if I put that one up there, then move this one and bring it down one point and do the same with another one drop that down there I could actually bring it actually I won't worry about that I'll put that there like that so I got the belt will run straight into that one will run out there and will run into there and then I'll run it through those and out there and then this one will run out this side so let's play that through hopefully this chromatic uh, not the chromatograph hopefully the centrifuges will kind of settled down so that we're getting three coming through in a line here at all times and if it doesn't quite I might just change around these belts a little bit if I can shunt everything over just a little bit it give me a bit more space with the belts that's what I might need to do actually it doesn't seem to be coming through exactly one and one which is a little bit of a shame, really. But anyway, we got we got them coming through here, so we now have a catazone crystal which fights cancer. We now need another catalyst, and we need to get the concentration up to 19 to 20. We need a five-point catalyst. So first of all, let's go to our ingredients and have a look here. And we want this five... We've we got a five-point catalyst right here. Um, i got another one down here. So I got one there which is on a painkiller, and then I got one here which just causes memory loss. Right, let's try this one here. The raw Jackia essence. So I want to import that one. And I'm gonna bring that one in. I'll bring that one in on this gate here because I want to change the concentration. No, I don't. I won't change the concentration yet. I'll worry about getting the catalyst combined into it first. Then we'll see about the other one. So that is on the second line. 
this one here, the one that I need, is also on the second line. So I've got to shake him around a little bit. I don't think I'm going to use the centrifuge this time. I'm just going to use some shakers. So if I take a look at the shaker and... Right, this is a two-way one. So if I put that one there and that one there, we'll run this belt into here and the belt into here. Then that comes out back that way a little bit. That'll run there and come out that way. So it runs through the shaker. That's splitting up quite nicely. That's doing exactly as it should. These over here seem to have stopped altogether. I'm not quite sure why. Uh, oh, maybe it's because... I don't have the belt on there. Let me put that one on. Right, now it's moving through. So I've got this one here. I've got this is now on the... The fight cancer bit is on the second line. After going through the shaker. Before it went through the shaker, it was on the first line. This one is on the first line. And so I can hopefully now mix the two together. And that one will combine with that one to make up exactly what we're after. But what I can do, I, got, I need two ingredients coming in. If I put one here, put, uh, if I, I'm going to have to run it down a little bit further. I'll, if I delete that one there and that one. This will run round straight in that side and then this one over here can run straight down into there. I don't actually need to worry about anything extra. That one can run in that side, and then I go straight across the belt there and into that side. I get the two of them coming out this end. I hope. Uh, now we just need to make sure that... Right, so... Uh-oh. Does it come... Oh, yes, it does. It's, it's worked. Right, we've got all of them together. That's coming out exactly as it should. That's what I want there. I've got the... Uh, Fights Cancer now is the... I've got the five-point catalyst... And I need to get it up to 19 or 20, and then I've got to upgrade it with this sequencer. So at the moment, the concentration is 12, so I need to go up by uh, 7 points. Now, the best way to do that is with the cheaper ones. Um, this doubles the concentration, but it's not that... You know, it's not cheap. It's quite expensive to run. So if I put one of those up there... I'll remove that one a minute. I run the belt... Oh, I didn't like that. Remove that. What's wrong with that? That one can go straight into there. Then that one goes into there. I see why I didn't like it. Right. I want another agglomerator to increase the concentration again. I'll put that one down there. And then finally, we want the evaporator because that's the cheapest one that we can get. I'll put that one right next to it there. Put a belt and put a belt. And then have a belt coming out here. And now this one should be the right uh, concentration really sure if these are working correctly or not. We may still have to move all the belts around, but I do have enough room to shunt everything sideways a little bit. So I can do that later on if I need to. Uh, now, we've got the causes memory loss. The fight's cancer right there. We've got the five point and the right concentration. So now we need to put in a sequencer. This one allows you to directly specify concentration within a set, set, a set of fixed values. I've not used this one before. Oh, I just want to have a, another look. How long does it take? Right, this is a process time of three. So I'm... Invalid once position. Again, I'm going to try and put three of these in succession uh, so that I can maximise the production. If I put two of them like that and I put another one out here, I'm hoping... There we go. Right, let's have a look at this. Uh, choose. Oh, I see. Ah, you can... You can Basically, you can specify how it comes out. We might use that after it, because it's... We don't know what concentration we're going to want once it's run through here. So let me take that and put it in there. That one's going to run straight into there, and I'm going to have another one that's going to run into there. I'm going to have one exit point coming out that way. Another exit point onto there, and a final exit point that's going to cross over there. And here is our final point. Let me just pause that. So we have the multiple cirrhosis upgrade again, and we need it to be a 5 to 6. So can I change this? What can I do? I can change that to a 10. Can I not change it any further? 
Ah, I see. So you, you've got uh, just particular values to choose from. I need five or six. So if I just put it to that and then I upgrade it by three, I need an ionizer. So if I remove two belts there, actually let's remove another belt. Uh, go to basic and ionizer decrease. Oh, no. Sorry, an agglomerator. Increase the concentration and run out that way like that. That should now flow through this one here. Defa side quartz. Uh, I need to get it to... Oh no, I, I usually run to run the catalyst through first in case it changes the concentration of it. That's alright. Keep it like that. Right, the multiple sclerosis. I got the 5, 6. I need a 6 point catalyst. Alright, yeah, we will remove that one. We'll do, we'll do it how I have been doing it previously. Let's sell that and remove those. That's all paused. Now, I need a 6 point catalyst. Do I have a 6 point catalyst? One there. Uh, right, this is the only six point catalyst, so I've got to bring that one in. I'll upgrade this one. Uh, let's upgrade it a few times. So I'm bringing in this one. That one's already upgraded quite a bit. I am bringing in this one. And I'm also bringing in this one. So let's upgrade that one. I can go up another eight, right? So we've got that one and I'll start importing this one. Causes permanent paralysis. Uh, bring this one in. That one I'm going to... Where am I going to bring that one in? If I bring that one in here, I need some mixers. Right, so I need the third one on the list, and I need the top one on the list. So let's just chuck them through the mixer and see what they do. So I want a multi-mixer. I put... Uh, let's put one there and one there like that. I'll have a belt running from here. That will run straight into the side. And another belt that will run into that side. Then this one here will run into that top piece there. And it will also run across and into the top piece there. I bring an exit point here and press play. Right. Uh, that's going to combine. I think that's going to take the top two. Displace those in the other ingredient. Right. Uh, so I got four on there, that's the third one that I need. Third one down, and I also need the top one. Am I going to have those, oh no, I want the second one and the third one to mix. So I might need to use a centrifuge for this rather than um, the mixers. I've got a feeling I'm going to need to put in another set of centrifuges for this one. Because I don't think it's going to work, I think it's just going to mash it up as it is. It's not going to do exactly as I need it to. Put those together. And yes, it's not coming out as I wanted. I need that multiple sclerosis bit and it's not bringing me that. It's giving me... It's exactly the same as it went in. So this isn't going to work like this. I think what we're going to need is three centrifuges. So... Ooh, hang on, yeah, let's sell those and sell. I'm going to have to set up another three centrifuges like this so that I can uh, get the correct ingredients all mixed together. If I delete all of these belts really quickly, and then I will throw down three centrifuges. Uh, we want the advanced, no, we don't. We don't want the advanced, we want the centrifuge like that. And I'll bring that down a bit. One, two, Three, right. Now, uh, belts. I've got to bring this one up and in that end. Then I'm going to bring one in that end, and that one's got to go in there. Then I want this drug to go in there. And a second one. It's got to cross over here and then go into that one. And then it's going to have to cross over again and go into that one. Now, I'm pretty sure that's what I did over here, isn't it? Did I do something? No, I didn't. I or did I? Yeah, that's gone in there. It's crossed over once and it's crossed over again. It's exactly the same as what I did, but it didn't work out very well. I don't know why it's it's not flowing. It's not flowing precisely as it should. Uh, never mind. Right. Let's put some exit belts on and we'll press play. And what do I need? I need I need the second one combined with the third one, don't I? Yes, so let's just pause that a moment. 
I need the second and the third one combined. So if I do it like that on each of them, change those two, that one there and that one there, and we'll run those through. Hopefully this will work and I'll be able to get the two coming out as I need them. Right, it's, it, here, we, here we go, here we go. It's, it's, it's putting them in, spinning them around. They've all changed to pretty colours. Right, what do we got? Uh, this one's given me the multiple sclerosis and this one has given me... No, that's not how I want it. Just pause a moment. Right, so why didn't it do it? I need that one and the third one. Ah, it's got to swap them over, hasn't it? So, actually, yeah, it was it was correct the first time. Uh, not like that. I want to do it that way, don't I? Like that. There. Okay. Let's try that again. I'll have to delete these belts, I think, so that um, they come out correctly now. Yeah, I'll have to delete the belts again. Delete those. Let's try again. Right, now they're coming out different colours. What have we got? Uh, multiple cirrhosis and permanent paralysis. Yes, and then this one over here, we can have an antidepressant. It doesn't have... It does have one other side effect. Uh, we need to do something with that. Because we've got this extra drug coming out on the line, we've got to do something to get rid of it. Um, I can only remove that with a cryogenic condenser. And then the other one... This one here, I need to upgrade now with the Hadron Collider. Okay, I am running out of room. Fast. What's going on here? Why have I got two belts here? Oh, I need to join that in. That'd be why this top one's not working. Okay, now I need... Uh, I've got to have two extra lines in. Right, first of all, let's get the Hadron Collider in. This is four. Uh, I'm just going to put two of them in. I wonder if I can fit four. Let's see if I can fit four of them in. If I can put one, two, that one won't. I'd have to go back up there, and I'm not sure if I can cross over the belts in the correct... No, I can't. I cannot cross the belts over the correct way if I do it that way. I can put another one there, or I could put... I could put one there. I could put a second one there, like that. Uh, but then I can't run another one. I can't get it go to run past it. So that one's got to move. I can put it there. Like that. That would work. Uh, hmm. Right, let's not worry about that too much for the moment. I can always play around with this afterwards and get the right concentrations going into the right places. I didn't mean to sell that. So I want this one here. Uh, it's got to be five to six before I upgrade it with that one anyway. But I tell you what, I'm going to pause and I'm going to move this around a bit. I'm going to shuffle this back a little bit so that I got room and see if I can't produce this. You know what? I'm not going. I'm going to just remove a mixer. Sell that one. Get rid of that line up through there. I'll get back to you in a moment. I know this episode is running a bit over. Um, I wasn't actually I was intending this to be the last episode, but I think we can still play around with uh, a few other bits So if I do one more episode and that will be the final one I sort of then will have touched on uh, just about everything this game has to offer So thank you very much for watching. This is Frithgar. I hope you enjoyed this I'll shuffle these things around a little bit between now and the next episode and then we can get to Putting down the final pieces of machinery and hopefully making this line work um, So goodbye and see you later